Good to see you again, Hitchhiker's Mindless Bow here. And we're back for episode two of Stranded on Planet X. Now, there's a few things. It took me like three hours to upload the video, so I watched a few videos online, finally taking off my media blackout. And I see I missed a few very obvious things while I was in my original campsite here. There might be something of kind of neat interest in here for me. Yeah, we got an accelerated fire towel, a photo, photon cannon fires at an increased rate. There's these few things here that requires the Atlas Path, or the Atlas Pass Volume 1. We've seen the Volume 2 in uh, the second kind of uh, location we found in the last video. I don't know what the hell that was. was. We might have to go check this out. A Gragra. Gas inhaled by Viking warriors to temporarily increase lung capacity and allow high quality battle screams. Outlawed by many peace agreements throughout the galaxy, many of which are now broken. Hmm. Now before we move on, I see I need some Thamian 9 in order to fuel my pulse engine before we're fully going to take off here. But we're going to try to take this ship out for a spin and see if we can land it over at the first little save point area that we found. Our Rasa Mama S36. Where's our little area we're at? I think we might have to adjust some controls here in a second. Alright, I'm not sure how to do this. ourselves down. This is kind of disorientating. It's not inverted, or I guess normal. I always get the two mixed up. So that's going to take a boost too. Let's see. First little area was. Alright, so we actually made it to our first little area we made it to. And how in the world did I not notice the cave entrance there before? Is that new? We might have to go check that out, people, but. Wow, this is looking pretty intense in here. <laughs> yeah, it's pretty looking. like we end up here. Oh no. Looks like it continues on. Uh, so we got a crouch button. Yeah, we don't yet have the weapon where we can just <clears throat> mine through the floor yet. So it looks like our cave exploring was cut short unless this other path might hold something of interest. some of this plutonium here while we got the chance. Now there might be a path up here. I don't know if we can break past these, whatever they are. I 
think we can break through that with the equipment that we currently have. Seem to be pointed in the basic direction. This is it right over here. Oh, 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 oh. Yeah, well, oh, look how much quicker it's a starship. We're gonna land right over. I think. Alright, we didn't land on top of anything. Alright, nice. Loving the jetpack. I was wondering how we can get up there. There's really no limits in this game, really, other than the ones you make for yourself. I wonder if we're going to have something tasty and electronic in here. Plus another building I didn't think I searched last time. Accelerated Fire Theta. Photon Cannon Companion Unit. I think that's the same thing I kind of picked up on. I think I picked up a towel. Alright, let's see if we can go inside here. Things are a bit trashed in here. Alright, let's see if we can get in through another entrance. Analyze multi-tool tech. Beam Focus Sigma. Faster mining beam processes a resource-rich materials. Nice. I'll have to start looking into building some of this stuff. Alright, well, now I need an Atlas path to get into the main building. There's no point in going back in there. By trap bypass chip required. Looks all busted up. Let's see if we can make a bypass chip here. Alright, we got enough stuff to make that. Shelter marker, detection wavelength online, local transmission station, blah blah blah, online, and Ant alien antiquity marker detection online. Please select preferred destination. Monolith, colonial outpost, transmission, and shelter. Well, I think we're going to definitely want to see what the monolith is. Alright, we've done some naming. We got now the Lambda system. I finally gave it a name off of good old Half-Life. Uh, we finally had to upload the waypoints in order to make them official as well. I didn't change their names. Somebody else already kind of found them and gave them their names, so I'm quite happy with that. But we come up with a few names. We have our Banana Cactus. Unfortunately, for some odd reason, I can't name him. I already uploaded him and didn't name him before I did so, and I every time I hit the button to rename and upload, it won't let me do so. I got the yellow scrub flower, the cluster mug cactus, a blue betty, looks a lot more blue in person, the little lamp light, a fallout reference, the goo geyser, a gorlop, he's about my favorite animal on the planet so far next to the thing that I couldn't name. Couldn't really figure out what the hell this picture was or where I discovered it, so I called him Plant X. Then we got another very different type of cactus, just like the last one, so I called him a caddy cactus. And we got a couple more things here on the next page. For some odd reason, he doesn't show up on the records. But I got a yellow spotted Felinus, a royal core blobble, a true blue. I left his name as I found him, the S Zenite, because he's just a rock. I really don't need to rename rocks. A plum cactus, a calamar tree, and that's a calamari joke because it looks like a squid upside down. 
And my favorite, the blister back bleedle. Isn't he a bleedle? Look at him. Look at him bleedling around. Couldn't think of any other way to describe him. Look, there's one of our yellow spotted felinuses now. We're not going to worry about him. to do next, what to do next. Got a new thing on our waypoint, you know? Kind of got the idea in my head that let's go see what's up above our planet real quick. We're going to come back. But I just want to kind of see what's out here first. Kind of see what our planet looks like and what's nearby. Oh, oh, oh. Crap atmosphere. Of our power isn't running out. There we go. We've made it out to our officially to the Lambda system. Nope, nope, nope. Let's take a look around out here into the majesty that is No Man's Sky space. Got to be more out here than just Planet X. Do a scan. What is this over here? We got a space station over here. I don't think we got enough fuel to go exploring out there, though. Oh, we got another planet over here. Let's see what we can go look at here. Got right, our ship. Got to get used to these ship controls. Hope we don't run out of gas out here. There we go. There's our boost. Yeah, our pulse engine don't got too much fuel. back into the atmosphere. What does that say over there? Off-planet beacon. What does it bring up information about the planet? Am I not close enough yet? I mean, I imagine that's a moon. It looks like it's a moon. Yeah, moon of planet X. Jesus. Oh, shit. What do we shoot with? There we go. Oh, it's Damien. That's exactly the kind of stuff we were needing, too. Arrive in 19 minutes. try to go that far. kind of want to go back to our starting planet and fully explore, but I kind of want to check out our moon at the same time. Ah, fuck it. Let's go check this shit out. Oh, shit, 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 shit. floating around here like crazy now. Alright, yeah, I've already discovered Planet X. <laughs> I am 
gotta be there. Where the hell is the other planet? That's our star. So where's our moon? How did we lose the moon? Alright, we're engaging the pulse engine. Okay, disengage, disengage. Oh, this is kind of not looking like a friendly planet here. What do we got over here? Coming on to the moon of Planet X. very dark, nasty kind of looking place. Let's land down here and see what we got. Radioactive moon, radiated winds, regular sentinels, fair and intermittent flora and fauna. Alright, so definitely already taking radiation damage, and we need to redo our shields here. Um, some more iron. Comes in many different shapes and size and forms. Do I hear something huffing at me? Oh, there's where we're going. There's where we're going. We don't want to get too carried away here. Oh, here we go. What do we got over here? Looks like some type of land camel. Let's go over and say hello. Oh, oh, oh. Ooh. Land camel. Land camel is not friendly. Alphalon Fiumvinu. Alright, he's definitely pretty much worn me to staying away. So we're going to push that a little bit and see if we can't feed him or make him our friend. Definitely got some type of camel sack action going on. Oh, oh. Uh oh, we got another milestone. I actually missed a few while I was kind of setting up this play. Can't remember what they were for. I traveled 10,000 U. Sweet. Alright, we're gonna go ahead and uh, claim this place here. By the way, I think that's our planet over there, maybe. Or maybe, no, maybe that's Planet X. So I wonder if that's another planet and another moon over there. Oh, we got the sun coming out. Where's the sun coming from? <coughs> All right, looks like we found the door here. And it looks like it's locked. We got sentinels all over the place. I don't know whether to break the door down or not. I imagine they would take offense to that. We got a Corvax Convergence Cube. Device used by the Corvax for the storage of historical and cultural information. Hmm. All right, we're gonna go ahead and try to blow this door open. Not even close. Definitely ain't happening. Not with our current gear. But I think we explored enough on this planet. I think we're going to go back to uh, good old Planet X. You know what? Maybe should we get, should give this planet a name first and save before we head off. Alright, so we named our moon Zillion, which is a Godzilla reference. Huge Godzilla fan. And our little critter we found is an Exilian moon camel. So I think we're going to head back to uh, Planet X now and finish our job there before we start branching out. Maybe we'll come here next again. Alright, once again, blasting back off. <clears throat> Let's 
getting there back in the direction of our planet here. All right above us, there we are. Oh, I wonder if Planet X has two moons. Well, let's go back home. Initiating pulse engine. <laughs> home sweet home. like a portal maybe from the picture of it all right so we seem to be getting no cover to our model kind of touch down here and see if we can save our game and end this video since we've kind of seen a good fit for this one all right hitchhikers this is mindless bow stick your thumb out and subscribe if you want to hitch a ride with me to the center of the galaxy